begin this afternoon's plenary session with a report out titled Organizational Strategies for Instantaneous Project Controls. RT316 has found that using near real-time data is critical to making better, more reliable decisions for more efficient and more successful projects. Here to present the team's findings is Doug Weaver, Senior Project Manager at Woolbridge. Thank you, Gonzalez Productions. <laughs> Instantaneous project controls, a continuous feed of data and an on-demand accurate reporting. How old's the information you're using when you're making your critical decision? Hours, days, weeks, months, longer than that? I won't make you use the clickers, but how would you like to have on-demand access to your current project status information when you want it. We, most of you have heard this story at least once, but I want you to think about it a little differently this afternoon. 240 years ago, right here in Boston, two lanterns were hung in the North Church steeple. The information that they conveyed had been previously coordinated and blessed by the Sons of Liberty. The information was of such high quality and so reliable that two signers of the Declaration of Independence avoided British capture. It was instantaneous, and it was essential to events that changed the world forever. And it wasn't technology alone. I'd like to introduce Research Team 316, tasked with investigating instantaneous project controls. Our goal was to develop practices, recommendations, and tools for an instantaneous and prioritized project controls function that would yield precise, adequate, and timely information. To do this, we developed a four-step research process. First, we surveyed CII membership to determine the current controls condition and how it affects current business practice. Secondly, we developed a multiple case study analysis to determine the best practices and strategies for supporting instantaneous project controls. Third, we determined the benefits and barriers to instantaneous controls. And lastly, we developed tools that were um, tested by subject matter experts. Consider the, the expectations of information communication in today's fast-paced, complex, technology-driven capital delivery process. The result is there is a growing expectation for always more and more information it faster and faster. Through an historical perspective, we can correlate the pervasiveness of information technology through time. With the result of we are now dominated by the presence of all sorts of technology information and applications that promise and deliver the expectation to collect and report information on demand. Research Team 316 has actually documented organizations who are using real-time information transfer for a competitive advantage. Obviously, technology is fundamental to the instantaneous project control systems, but don't be lulled into thinking that it is instantaneous project controls, because it's not software or technology alone. 
Instantaneous controls must be supported by an organizational maturity. So if it's not technology, what is it? Through rigorous research and industry evidence, we have identified an, a holistic organizational approach that we've, that we've named the maturity matrix of practices that supports instantaneous project controls. Maturity matrix is made up of three categories, organizational behavior, project controls, and advanced information technologies. Supported by nine strategies or practices which need to be implemented in proper sequence. We have also documented failed attempts to install or implement instantaneous project controls where organizations have installed technology without respecting the implementation sequence. A culture of innovation must be encouraged. Leadership must have a sustained vision for instantaneous controls and they must communicate it continuously. Contracts must ensure that the data communication chain remains unbroken. Coding structures must be designed around the uh, information technology so that information can be seamlessly traded across organizations and functions, such as estimating, design, and construction, or subcontractors, contractors, and owners. Data collection must be clean, concise, and complete. It must be continuous, and, it must, and it's preferable that it starts from this source. Reporting priorities must be ascertained to Reporting priorities must be ascertained to support the reports required at all levels of the reporting function. They must be reliable, adequately detailed, and properly formatted to enable informed decision making at all times. Information must be integrated so to be seamlessly transferred across organizational boundaries. Integrated information supports transparency and allows for more reliable reported information. Processes and procedures must be designed around the selected information technologies so that they are simply and easily implemented and enforced with minimum effort and cost. We have also identified analytical functions that can alert to events or, or uh, uh, trends prior to their occurrence. What is the project controls IQ or instantaneous quotient? To answer that, RT316 designed three tools to implement, to help implement and improve project controls IQ. The quick assessment tool is rapid and easy to implement. It provides an approximation of the current level of instantaneous controls maturity. The instantaneous quotient tool provides a more detailed assessment of that maturity, and it also uh, recommends specified steps to guide users into the development and improvement of their instantaneous capabilities. The workflow implementation process provides uh, sequential steps for implementing and, and enabling instantaneous process controls. So if you have an instantaneous ca uh, capability, you can expect to uh, receive one or more of these following benefits. More timely and better informed decisions, more improved cost and schedule performance, more effective risk mitigation, more efficient capital management, and a more competitive edge in the marketplace. Come meet Research Team 316, hear our story, right here on the fourth floor at the back of the Grand Ballroom this afternoon and tomorrow morning. Come learn when instantaneous project controls provides the greatest benefits, discover what types of processes should be instantaneously reported, and understand how organizational maturity can enable instantaneous project controls. Hey, let's ride, y'all. <laughs>